Jose, congratulations. How pleased are you with the way you fought back after a difficult first half to, to win so emphatically? Yeah, I think the second half was really, really good. We didn't start bad. Um, of course, the goal was disallowed by offside, but we start quite well. But then we lost control of, of the game in, in the first half. Uh, that two strikers created us uh, problems. We couldn't control them very, very much. We can see the goal. That is a replica of a goal that we can see last season here with uh, a long ball behind behind our defenders and uh, Ings winning that that duel. Uh, second half, uh, great dynamic, uh, good impact from the two players coming from the bench, uh, very similar to Plovdiv. I just love the player that comes from the bench with a special attitude to help the team. I think Gio and, uh, and Lamel, they did that. Then Sonny was on fire and for me, Harry Kane, I know that people will tell me I'm silly in my analyze, but for me, Harry Kane, man of the match, uh, because of what he did for the team. Uh, sometimes people think striker is to score goals. Strikers is, is also to to give big dynamic to to the attacking uh, organization and with him dropping back and connecting the game in between the lines uh, for Sony to to attack spaces we create them problems that they couldn't that they couldn't resolve. And you talked about the, the performance of Gio when he came on. Can you tell us about the decision at half time to bring off in because he was very much involved in, in that equaliser just before half time. Yeah, but football is not just about one uh, one action. And to be honest, um, three or four players with with yellow cards. Uh, only us for us only Tangi, but for them uh, Romeo and uh, a couple of two more players with with yellow cards. I think work pros. And I felt in the second half with the game a little bit broken for Tangi would be a risk. Was a risk also for them. In fact. Romeo was very, very close to get the second yellow card. That's why Ralph uh, changed him during the game. I decided to change Tangi also because I knew that Gio would give us a little bit more because he's in a better condition than, than Tangi. So for me, Harry dropping in between the lines, plus the dynamic that, uh, that Gio gave us in, in midfield in the second half, we were too good for them.